welcome friends let's discuss quantum mechanics the so question number 1 is what is quantum mechanics answer is quantum mechanics deals with the particle nature of radiation and wave nature of matter matter means particle it is actually concerned about wave particle duality and only fast moving micro particles are discussed in quantum mechanics question number 2 is what is the difference between classical and quantum mechanics answer is classical mechanics deals with the macro particles that move very slow speed as compared to the speed of light whereas quantum mechanics deals with the micro particles that move very high speed comparable to the speed of light question number 3 is what is wave particle duality it's very important question answer is wave particle duality means both matter and radiation have dual nature sometimes they act like a wave and sometimes they act like a particle but both these behaviors can never be observed in a single experiment this unique behavior of matter and radiation is called wave particle duality question number 4 is what is de broglie hypothesis answer is according to de broglie hypothesis particles also have dual nature like radiation and so particle can move in the form of waves so whose wavelength is equal to lambda is equal to h over p yeah lambda is equal to h over mv next question is what is wave function answer is the wave which is associated with a moving particle is represented by a function called wave function next question is what are the properties of an acceptable wave function answer is wave function must be finite wave function must be single valued and wave function and its partial derivatives must be continuous everywhere these are the properties that must be fulfilled for a wave function to be acceptable question number 6 is why are operators used in quantum mechanics answer is operators have tremendous importance in quantum mechanics because an operator operates on a wave function and produces some eigen value in other words operators are used to extract information about the system via wave function question number 7 is what is hilbert space it is also very important question answer is hilbert space has tremendous importance in quantum mechanics because it is as important in quantum mechanics as phase space in classical mechanics it contains all the possible states of a system this is why hilbert space is also called a complete space question number 8 is what is normalization condition answer is the probability for a particle to be found somewhere in space must be unity unity mean 100% this condition is called normalization condition question number 9 is what is hamiltonian operator answer is total energy of a system is represented by a hamiltonian operator total energy mean kinetic energy plus potential energy question number 10 is what is the physical significance of wave function answer is although wave function has no direct physical significance because it is a complex quantity but still indirectly wave function contains all the information about the system question number 11 is what is observable answer is anything which can be measured is called observable like position energy momentum etc 